My name is Susan DeFreitas. I'm Desmond Hall. I'm Tiffany Yates Martin. I'm Gwen Hernandez. I'm Catherine Kraft. And I'm Heather Webb. I'm Teresa Ann Fowler. I'm Greg McAllister. Hi, this is Don Moss. I'm Therese Walsh, and it's my pleasure to introduce you to the Brighter Unboxed on Conference, all in the 2023 edition. You've gotten halfway through your novel and You've run out of gas. Many of us are struggling to engage with our art after several years of chaos. Whether it's because we feel we have less time for it or less focus. This is a really challenging time in trying to be a professional writer or make a writing career for yourself. Like it or not, when you write, you are constrained. Despite having written several novels, sometimes we just get stuck. So what that pressure can do is actually stifle or even paralyze those of us who are trying to produce. But here's the thing, outstanding writing can happen on any page on any day that you write. What connects us to a story is what comes from the heart. We don't have to be felled by chaos, rather we can learn to use it. Voice in fiction. Every writer imagines that they have a strong voice, but that isn't always the case. It's one of the number one things that agents and editors will tell you that they are looking for. We're given so much advice to cultivate our unique writing voice. Voice isn't only a matter of speaking, it's what that voice is saying. But what exactly is it? Character. Character is the lens through which we experience stories. I have two sessions that are debuting at the conference. They're both on character. One is why are your characters the way they are? The other is bringing character to life on the page. Many of the sessions that I'll be leading, much of that work is based in character. Backstory is crucial to your story, but it is not the story. Knowing which part to include in your story is some of the most important work of creating real, fully fleshed, believable, relatable characters. And the way that you're conveying emotions through your character's point of view, that can make all the difference in the world. We want stories with strong emotion in them. We want to be moved. The story. You've just finished reading a really good novel and you can't move on to anything else because that story just isn't done with you yet. The page causes us to relate to stories that are far removed from our own era, our familiar places, or even cultures far different than our own. The best way to learn how to see in your own stories is by learning to analyze other people's. Once you learn it, you can use it to analyze anything that is story. And as I always say, everything is story. We're gonna talk about using techniques from the film world and how to integrate these techniques from dialogues to story writing to act structure. Three act structure, four act structure, save the cat, the hero's journey. Now everybody's excited about story grid. So many writers struggle with the question of how to structure their novel. And how do you make it come alive in your work? You may be frustrated trying to figure out why your process doesn't match and wondering if you're doing it wrong. Spoiler alert, you're not. So what I want to talk about is how to navigate those pressures. What would it be like to write without constraints? And I'll show you practical ways to address those. Once you've figured out what's stalling your story, how you can implement strategies that will get it going again. We are going to stress test your ideas, your plots, everything. We're gonna really get in there and chop it up like the kids say. What's the best single page that you have ever written? Well, guess what? You're going to write that page on the final day of the Unconference 2023. And we're going to help to get that flame going again. I've seen the transformations that happen in people's work. Looking forward to digging into this thorny issue with you all. So I hope that there'll be a lot of takeaway from this session. And I'm hoping you will bring a willingness to discuss a little bit about how you write. Bring your manuscripts and your story ideas. We're going to talk about what you're working on. The send your protagonist all the way through to the end. We can talk a little bit about what we're going to do with all of this and, and who we are fundamentally as creatives. Help you to find your center again. Remember your strengths. That becomes your fuel and your propulsion. We are genuinely so excited about the event. We have wonderful contributors who'll be there. I promise you it will be easy. I promise you it will be fun. It's going to be a lot of fun. I can't wait to see everybody. I can't wait to spend this wonderful week in this 
paradise place, and we hope that you'll be able to join us. And I look forward to seeing you in Salem. See you in Salem. I will see you in Salem. Or see you in Salem. I really, really hope to see you there this fall. Can't wait to see you in November. I'll see you in Salem. See you up in Salem. See you in Salem. I'll see you in Salem.